What's up, y'all? This your boy, Movie Man Greg, coming at you guys with another episode of um, The Sopranos. Uh, we are on episode four. Oh, dude, Brandon just got murdered. And I knew that was going to happen because my man was tripping. But I thought they were going to actually have Christopher murder him as a penalty. But um, so that's going on. And then, you know, all the stress of life with Tony is going on. You know, his mama tripping, Junior tripping, everybody tripping right now. His boy dying, so life is looking a little grim. But um, I'm excited to get to episode four. Let's see what's about to happen. Um, just remember, if you want to see these episodes unedited, in full, uh, watch it along with me. All you have to do is become a member. Um, the link will be at the bottom, also my community tab. Or you can go to patreon.com forward slash the number two epic. All right, I'm excited, but let's not waste no more time. I am about to get to this episode. Let's go. So I wonder, is he going to be with this therapist throughout the entire series? Like, is this something that's going to be... You're going to say something or what? Every day. What's he doing here? Oh, he imagining him. A friend of mine just... Oh, he dreaming. There's a lot going on right now. Oh yeah, there's definitely a lot going on. He dream he definitely dreaming. <laughs> he like, hey. What is Paulie doing here? Dr. Melfi, what the hell are you doing to me? That's his mama. <laughs> Woo, having nightmares about mama. Yeah. Compact with Donna Barone sanitation. His son don't believe that shit. Yeah. Go. Watch out for the ghost. What the hell is you doing? Mr. <laughs> what? Yeah, what? No, what? You don't want to know, okay? Oh, shit. Oh. Was she... Was she hot? the nurse say you made number two in your pants? Is that what happens? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Can we just go to Brendan's, score some shit, and find out what the fuck is going on? Please. Mm, he don't know Brendan's there yet. Who leaves his door open? Please. Go for it. Yo, Einstein. Ah, oh, shit. She about to discover the body. Understand and comply. Damn. Damn. Way to go, Ann. Here is in five, four. What the hell is about to go down? Yeah, <laughs> maybe she does, right, Ann? Yeah. Oh, yeah? Then why'd you scarf up all the donuts she sent us at camp? And Damn. used to cry on her shoulder. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Okay, why is he acting out though all of a sudden? A five minute cool down period? Can I help you, sir? 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 <laughs> he looking so suspicious. Mm, he don't want, don't want them to know that he's going. He sees me, they tell somebody else, all of a sudden I'm a celebrity. I thought we made some progress on your narcissism. <laughs> Question. So, your mother did teach you something. Ooh, time to get into, what is mama? Why? If something happened? Must be my dad, right? Why else would Chris send you? Did Brendan get my poem? Yeah. Brendan got the poem, all right. What did you tell your old man? About the meth? Are you insane? He got me beaten up. I Don't you get it? It's a serious... Ah, oh, shit. Slow the fuck down. Okay, let's go. Remember, like, when you were little? I'll buy you one of those Happy Meals, all right? Yeah. <laughs> But they're your favorites. Okay. 
She just being difficult just to be being difficult at this point. To the city, then they're in a show. And you don't want to go. Of course you don't want to go. What do you care? Out of sight, out of mind. She's a real Debbie Downer, man. I wish the Lord would take me. L listen, listen, man. Whew, I couldn't be around her. You know, I come in to get cheered up. You think that's a mistake? Yeah. You're being sarcastic. She really want him. She just don't want him to know that she really want him. Prison junkies. Plus, it's a super huge thrill to pay two alimonies on a $40,000 a year income. Yeesh, that gotta be rough. Like you can have a box, man. You just piss, then wash your hands, then you gonna dig. Man, just take the box. Ah, oh, Jackie looking bad. Caliber in his eye. Fucking Mikey Palmisi does their hits. And his glasses, you mean? Glasses, eyes. Why are you quibbling with me? <laughs> Santa. What? Then he killed my friend. I response to suit the message. Yeah, that's not gonna be good. No. He tries to leave, you break his other neck. Break his other neck? Talking about his thing thing? Eesh. Mm, what do you see? Oh, he see that staple gun. Hey, Mr. GQ. Got a ticket. Yeah. How you doing, Mikey? Oh, he about to touch Mikey. Uh! Laid his ass out. Oosh! 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 Your suit's wrinkled. Here, let me fix it up for you. Oh! What are you screaming about? For your alterations. Oh! oh. oh. <clears throat> Mr. St oh! Damn. Staple my man's shirt to his chest. Don't pretend you're paying me respect. A son who throws his mother in an asylum. She lives like a poveretto up there. Eesh. Good people than you, my friend. Oh, uh -huh. Like Jackie? Want to take this to his deathbed? Eesh. Maybe he gives you, Ajita, for a change. Oh man. Ah oh, shit. Ah oh, shit. What's anymore? Huh? Out. Next time you come in, you come heavy or not at all. Woo! Woo! Oh shit! Yo. He just said that to Tony, yo, yo nephew. He said, next time you better come strapped, so don't come at all. Holy shit. Occasional grope in the closet. Yeah, <laughs> mm -hmm. something like that. Oh, wow. Oh, I don't believe this. Just relax, Randall, and do what he says, OK? Okay, you supposed to just be getting information. This seems a little bit excessive. Not. You ever hear of probable cause? Oh yeah, that's a real good legal lead. Oh, oh shit! He's not supposed to be doing all this. Receive what I thought was a weapon. What the hell's wrong with you, man? Yeah. Take him. Uh, he just gonna do it. Shooters up a tuna sub and a diet coke. Let's get a three bedroom condo in uh, Essex Phil. Shops. You gonna tell him what you did? Sees a shrink once a week. His name is Elliot Kupferberg. Oh, fuck me. Your shrink is seen a shrink. That'll solve all your problems. My man's on some other shit. This, this lieutenant is on some. I heard Mikey had to give up that nice suit. Oh, yeah? Yeah, too attached. 
<laughs> Don't make things any easier. My uncle's a stubborn man. Stubborn enough to go to Yeah, it looks like it. No one's going to the mattresses this day and age. I got a top of the line pastopedic in my house. <laughs> I also got an 18 year old with MS, okay? I told Nucci I'd be doing less, not. Mm, he ain't trying to get. He ain't trying to get promoted. Oh, she's so fucking smart. And it's physically challenged. <laughs> not for anything. God bless your uncle. But he's living in the wrong century. And New York knows it. Do we, can he talk to New York? I don't want no disturbance. He might have to go around Junior, talk to New York, whoever that is. The organization, I guess, in New York. Get their attention, at least put a whistle in their ear. Yup, oh, here we go. Listen, just give me the money. That thing was so gay, I did you a favor. <laughs> oh, shit. Dickwad. Ooh, damn. That went friendly to hostile in less than three seconds. Ugh. Yeah, the pit tomorrow, three o'clock. Oh shit, it's about to go down. Three o'clock tomorrow at the pit. Wherever the hell that's at. Dogs for the boys. Tony, I, uh, I don't even know if these guys are close anymore. Oh shit. Oh, so he did tell us that. Linda, Linda. But, <laughs> that's great, Tony, that's great. I'll see you around. He ain't pick up on that vibe at all, but Junior ain't been telling him shit. Something that's about to be added to his stress. Ooh, he about to pass out. Breathe, bruh. Breathe. Well, there we go. He's got more degrees than a thermometer. Don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. Oh, so you don't you don't know his therapist. He didn't tell her therapist is a woman. Because I don't understand. I'm telling you, Tony, if you give up now, I'm gonna have to reevaluate things. Eesh. What is that? Yeah. A marriage, Tony. Therapy is too much exposure. Fine. You live with the results then. Oof. Yeah, hey, that's a promise. It's a rave review. Get your own fucking balls. It's a rave review. <laughs> hey, it's either you go to therapy or your wife walk out. And there's my mother. Made four grand a month for this place, and she acts like I'm an Eskimo pushing her out the sea. Huh? <laughs> Damn, four grand a month? Jeez. Oh, I read, I go right out. It's strategies for coping with elder family. Hey, it sounds like you need to read that damn book. You <laughs> can't spank them. Being in control. The illusion. That's the key word. You got to make them think the shit was their idea. You got to make them think that they run the shit. They came and took it. Who? Junior Sopranos boy. They said you was out in the state corner now. Ah. I'd rather give my 10 points to you. It's all right. Damn. It's not your fault. <laughs> I'm glad that you say that, man. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, we gonna choke him out with the yo yo? Kill you. Broke his yo-yo. Beat his ass with his own yo-yo, then broke it. What the fuck he got in his pocket? Oh, he about to pay him? Oh, yeah. shit! What the hell is that? What do you mean you can't? Just take it. He told his dad. You want, man? Yeah. Tony, you want? I'm leaving. 
They're like, man, we showed up to this shit. He told his dad, his dad was like, you better not fight him, shit. You know who his daddy is? His daddy is Tony Soprano. I ain't about to try to get me killed because you want to fight his son. Ah, oh, man. For the North Jersey Mafia two years ago. April was 44 years old. Thank you. That's how they found out that he died on the news? A great man. A great leader. A great friend. Shit is about to go downhill now. If Jackie is gone, his power, his control, which seemed like he had everything under control, it's about to be a power grab. We should go with him. You do what you're told. When you're told. Starting with shut the fuck up. <laughs> Calm the fuck down. Chill the fuck out. <laughs> For real. Like, I came in like you told me to. Hot and heavy. Need a leader. We do. Like, it ain't going to be you. That's why I want it to be you, Uncle Joe. Oh, shit. Give him the illusion. For the captains? I can. Come here. Give him the illusion that he running shit. Congratulations. Hmm. Uh, you know the rules. All righty. Sometimes you're so naive. Just what do you think Dad does for a living? Waste manager. Oh. Do you know any other garbage men who live on Uncle when he's not even related? He's in Dad's other family. Oh shit! Why well, I thought that was his real uncle? Holy shit! Oh no, Uncle Jackie. I'm thinking uh Junior. Yeah, Uncle Jackie. Wow. This is when internet was in its prime. I mean, it's in its early stages. Phone's off the hook. Come on in. Damn. Cops got him shit like that? Uncontrollably. Mm. Lady says next, I ran away. Damn. That trauma again, beat up by the cop, really fucked him up. Dress disorder. You, you couldn't prescribe something? I'm your date. Not your <laughs> you like you trying to get me fired? Yep, that got to be a a heavy realization, knowing your dad is in the mob. He had absolutely no idea. We'll tell you about how he got clipped because it was. Uh... She not even there. She date she. She out of it. My friend got beat up by a policeman, no less. Hmm. This the first time you're hearing about this. Yeah. This is my relationship with him will never be the same. Sorry. Oh, it wasn't your fault. It is. It is his fault. No, no, no. Give it another chance. Got a lot of good ideas here. <laughs> a lot of good ideas. He had, he read that book too. Yep, read that book. Gave Uncle Junior the power, the illusion of power. Yeah, and now you got Bloomfield and the Union Chair. <laughs> well, otherwise you'd fuck me, Larry, but you wouldn't respect me no more. <laughs> Most people went through World War II. All right, Tony. Seems like you're playing the kind of smart. Let's see how the fruits of your labor come to bear. T, check out the government. Damn, that's a big ass camera. His son soaking all that shit up. 
Ja. Question is how you feel about his dad living that life. All right, people. Let's see. And there we have it. The next episode down, episode four. It was a little bit slower on this side, but a lot has went on as far as the transfer of power. You know, Tony having a couple setbacks, but now I think he's doing a really he he's taking a step back to really strategize. So I'm 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 kind of curious to see what happens next when it comes to how he's going to give the illusion that Junior is running stuff, but still be pulling the strings from from afar. So I'm I'm, I'm excited to see what Tony's going to do with that. Um, it was also crazy to see, you know, what therapist was is going through. You know, she forgot she was in a therapy session with somebody where she's supposed to be coaching and mentoring and and you know and working on and then you know she's going through her own little traumatic experience um so uh it's it's it, this is very interesting to see i'm really curious to know is that going to be an everyday thing like is the therapy session something that's going to be a part of the show all the way through through all the seasons like i'm i'm interested like um to see exactly how far along that goes um, because it seems like it's an intricate part of the plot, you know, um, a good spot where Tony can kind of break things down or express things on a human on a human level. So I think that's what I really like about the therapy sessions. Um, yeah, no, nah, but uh, I really enjoyed the episode. But I know I, I got a feeling like shit is about to turn up. Not probably not next episode. I got a feeling this next episode is probably gonna be pretty slow too. But maybe the episode after that. I feel like shit might hit the fan, but hey, that's just a prediction. Um, well, I definitely want to say thank you guys. Again, consider becoming a member if you want to see these unedited. Make sure you like if you enjoyed yourself. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see more of my content. And with that being said, thanks again, and I'll catch you guys on the next reaction. Until then, peace.